Hi there. My name is Ryan Malloy here at the Worldwide Center of Mathematics. In this video, we're going to discuss how to solve equations with sine and cosine. Here we have two examples. We have sine of pi over 4 equals x and cosine of theta equals 1. We want to solve for x and theta. First is quite simple. All we need to know is what is the sine of pi over 4. Perhaps you have it memorized, or you can use a calculator, or you might have a chart of the unit circle with all of the sine and cosine values. But however you find it, you should know that x is equal to 1 over the square root of 2. Now this might be a little bit trickier. We want to find all the values of theta for which cosine of theta is equal to 1. Now if we draw ourselves a unit circle, Recall that cosine of theta is 1 right here when theta equals 0. But this is also true if we go all the way around the circle and theta equals 2 pi. And it's also true if we go around the circle the opposite way and theta is equal to negative 2 pi. So in fact, theta can be any integer, any even integer times pi. So let's write that out. Theta equals 2k times pi, where k is a member of the integers, where z is frequently used in mathematics to represent the set of all integers. And those are really our only two possibilities. So that's all there is to it. My name is Ryan Malloy, and we've just discussed how to solve equations with sine and cosine.